Don't forget to subscribe! Hey, where's Kisa? An anime. I'd never seen it, but all the kids at school seemed to like it, so... I... Huh? Oh. It's okay. Hey! Huh? You there. Pick that up. Come on, pick it up. Oh, right. Here you go. <laughs> what, are you stupid or something? Why'd you do that? Don't you have a mind of your own, or do you always do what people tell you? What if I told you to roll on the ground? Would you do that? Or how about if I told you to jump off a bridge? No, uh... You know, you'll never get anywhere unless you learn how to think for yourself. Well, as long as you picked it up, hurry up and give it back. What are you trying to do, steal it? Uh, oh, no, of course not. Hey. Huh? I came all this way to meet you. You could at least say thank you or something. Uh, oh, but I... Come on, the complete strangers tell you they came to meet you every day. Put it together. I think by now it should be pretty easy to guess who I am. But you're not too quick, are you? Uh, oh. Really? Everyone talks about you like you're something special. I don't see what's the big deal. You don't seem that great to me. You're pretty dull. Ah, uh, this was dumb. A total waste of time. Now you at least gotta treat me to a meal. <laughs> what's the problem? You want me to get something good out of this, don't you? Take me out to eat. Oh, well, I was just on my way to work. And I don't really have that much money with me. Yeah? Let's see your wallet. Uh, wait, I... <laughs> Man, what a cheap-looking bag. Wait, please. Ah, but here's something. This notebook's pretty nice. I like the color. I'll just take this. <laughs> no, you can't. That's... Oh, by the way, I doubt I'll ever see you again, so I might as well tell you. I'm Hirosoma. Bye. This must be your mom. Hmm. She's pretty hot. Well, isn't she just the little mama's girl? How boring. Why, do I need a permit or something? Do I have to have a reason to be here? Maybe I'm just sitting here because I want to. Or is that some kind of crime? And what, just because you asked, does that mean I have to answer? Maybe I don't want to tell you why I'm here. Yeah. Well, you're the one who's yelling. You. What, did you follow me here? How the heck did you find me? Oh, sure. So you just accuse me before you even know what's going on? Maybe I'm innocent. Ever think of that? All I did was take her notebook. Why should I? It's not like I stole it. That stupid girl asked me to take it. Go ahead. I'll just turn you into the police for child abuse. Hero. Hero, did you really take it? Sissy's notebook? <sighs> Isn't it obvious that dumb rabbit won and got her? Hero, please, you have to give it back. Don't cause any more problems for Sissy. It's not nice. Give it back, please. This is stupid. Here, I don't want this dumb thing anyway. Hero? Are you trying to be mean to Sissy on purpose? I don't understand why you're acting this way, but it makes me sad. Sissy, sissy, sissy. That's all I hear. I hate it. All you ever talk about is that stupid girl! In the video, you couldn't wait to run off and watch it with her. I let you borrow it because I wanted to watch it with you. But you... that's not what you said when you gave it to me. It's a pretty lame show, but you wanted to see it, right? Take it. I don't need to watch it again. You should have just... Told me. What, do I gotta spell it out for you every time? Take a hint! Hero, you're not being fair! Who asked you, rabbit? I mean, I know I wasn't much of a help. I couldn't do anything for you when you were having a hard time at school. But still, sissy sissy, she's all you talk about. What about me? I was there. I wanted to help. I did. I was... I was really worried about you too. I'm sorry, Hero, but next time, we'll watch the video together, okay? But, you know, I do think you should apologize to Sissy. <clears throat> Punished? What do you think you can do? So why does he look like this Lord Kaka guy if he's so afraid of him? He could just move out and stop being a bad guy if he really wanted to. And what's with that last line? It doesn't make any sense.
This is too sweet. You think just because we're young, we only want to eat this sugary stuff? What about coffee? You want our teeth to fall out or something? Oh, <laughs> I guess I didn't think about that. Figures, some people just have no consideration for others. Hero, don't worry, Kisa. It's okay. It's not okay. Be more careful next time. Oh, right. I definitely will. Hmm. Oh, what's this? Since when did the cat get to be the boss of this house? I mean, what right do you have to come in here yelling like you own the place? Do you pay the bills or something? Because I don't think you do. You can't just go around shouting orders if you're not going to take any responsibility. If you don't have something to back it up, all you're doing is acting like a whiny little kid. Gah, I thought they'd never leave. I mean, talk about annoying. Hey, go get me some more tea. Hero, what's wrong? It almost seems like you don't like Sissy. Because I don't. Well, I don't understand. Then why did you want to come here? Because I know that you like her so much. And because I want to take you to the places that you like. Yes, that's true. Whenever I'm around Sissy, she makes me feel all warm inside. I'm sorry. You know, he he's really very nice once you get to know him. I believe it. What with the way you two get along so well? For a while, I was afraid that Hiro didn't like me at all. Uh, when I was in elementary school, we used to play together all the time. But then when I started middle school, things got really awkward between us. All of a sudden, he didn't want to talk to me anymore. And I couldn't figure out why. That's why... That's why I was so surprised. It made me so happy. You don't have to work today, right? So take us somewhere fun. That's right, we came and we're tired of standing around, so hurry up and take us somewhere before we get even more bored. Uh, okay. Where would you like to go? What? Can't you even decide one simple thing by yourself? Don't you know if something's fun or not? Don't you have opinions? Do you think you can just sit back and let other people do all your thinking for you? Oh, yeah. What a wonderful way to live your life. I'm sorry. Um, but I really like it here. You're forgiven. <laughs> Thank goodness. Kisa, want one? I'll take chocolate. Okay. And Kisa, what would you like? Um, strawberry. Oh, no, wait. Is there something else you'd like? Uh-huh. Banana chocolate? Well, that sounds delicious, too. I'll get both and we'll share. <laughs> I'll pay for Kisa's. And as long as I'm at it, I'll go ahead and pay for myself. But I'm not paying for you. You buy your own. Okay. Now stand up straight. You look like an idiot down there. Right. I don't get it. There's nothing special about you. You don't have magic power, so how could a dumb girl like you do what I couldn't? Uh. Why does everyone say you're so great, huh? <laughs> Is it because you can really solve anyone's problems for them? Uh. Can you really make anyone's troubles disappear? Can you really save anyone? Well, no, I mean, not at all. And if you think I'm going to go for that pretend modesty stuff, you can forget it. Right. If it was her, if she had been in the same situation as me, could she have done anything more for Kisa than I did? I only did what I did because I loved her so much. I wanted her to know how much I loved her. I wanted everyone to know, even Akita. But... I couldn't face Kisa, and I couldn't stand up to Akita, so I ran away. I ignored her. Even when I found out the other kids were picking on her, I couldn't do anything. And the whole time, I was still telling myself that I loved her. I am a coward. Why is it? Why do I have to act like such a child? I couldn't do anything like a stupid little kid. And then she showed up, and I got so jealous. I feel like such a fool for acting like this. Just like a spoiled little child. I hate it. Why do I have to be this way? This isn't what I want to be. Why can't I be more grown up? You know, I wasn't really asking for your opinion, and if you think flattery's gonna work on me, don't even bother. It won't. I mean it. 
So, let's see if I got this straight. What you're saying is right now I'm nothing like a prince? Oh, uh, uh, <laughs> Well, I suppose that's true. Hold it. I guess that little speech was enough to earn you something, so this one's on me. Just don't get used to it. How stupid can you get? I mean, telling me I'm gonna be a prince? It's just dumb talk. It's not like she can back it up. Is she gonna take responsibility if I don't become one? Or if I can't? Hero, what is it? You're smiling. Did something happen? You just watch. I am going to be one for sure. Still, I'd rather die than tell her thanks. Hero, you forgot your change. I know Hero's been the one to ask lately, but I can't expect him to lead me by the hand forever. I'll never get anywhere if I don't learn how to speak up for myself more often. So I was wondering, I thought maybe this Sunday, um, if you don't mind, can you and me and Hero all do something together, please? Sure, it sounds fun. I guess I'm stuck with this girl whether I like it or not. Don't forget to subscribe! Don't forget to subscribe!